our life seems to be a journey. It's wonderful, but has diverse challenges. Sometimes we can face late tones and sometimes they're lost. We would like to be a sail which guides people who are in deep waters. And there are two projects that spur them on the new directions, Temo and Mikuru. The first project is Temo. Temo helps people who lay children alone and must make money in society. They are single moms. Single moms are responsible for both work and parenting alone. Because of this, they have many restrictions on finding a job. So, single moms naturally have financial difficulties. And there is a place established to recognize and solve this problem for single moms. It's Kumbi Salon, a workshop supported by Kumbo Kandami. Also, Kumbi Salon is operated under a work time option system, allowing the moms to do both work and parenting. With the moms, Kumbi Salon takes regular sewing classes and sells every product. So, single moms can work fluidly, earn money, and develop their own ability in this workshop. However, there are problems with the workshop. Cool by using cooling materials. In July, 
we are going to make a prototype with the design. After this, we are going to have interviews to get feedback and improve the bag. Then, we will release the finished bag through crowdfunding to secure funds for the workshop operation. After the funding, through a satisfaction survey we had before, we will improve the program. And after August, we would consider the sustainability of our project. We are thinking about the future direction of our project in various ways, such as finding many locations and expanding product lines. By achieving these goals, Sebo will enable single moms to have professional product planning skills. And this will promote sales by producing competitive goods. The revenue from the sales can make Pumbis a a more sustainable job than before. So, single moms can develop their abilities in the place where they can combine work and parenting. Starting with Pumbis Room, we will be a project that helps single moms entirely focus on their work and raise their children. The second project is Ripulu. With the community platform, this project would like to help middle-aged people suffering from the aftermath of retirement. Percent of retirees experience post-retirement defects, and the following psychological difficulties are caused by differences between daily life at work before and after retirement. First is emptiness in life. People cannot adapt to the sudden changes in routine caused by the disappearance of places to go to work. Second is the sense of social isolation. When they quit their job, their social network almost disappears. So, Nipperlo came up with routine application. Routine refers to the process of embodied habits to move retirees life in a better direction. Making their own routines, they can create productive habits in their daily lives while spending a late back day after retirement. In other words, Middle-aged retirees can fill the gap in their lives with routines and form social networks through communities. Reproach community is specialized for middle-aged people to use. The existing self-management apps have a community centered on young users. So, it was hard for middle-aged people to communicate in those applications. Therefore, Reproach would like to add a space to our platform for sharing information and communicating among them. Through the community, users introduce what things they did, writing a note about how difficult it was or what changes have occurred. Users can see improvement of other middle-aged lives through this reduce and choose different routines than new practice. We want to build application designs for middle-aged people to make them easier to use. Simplified sign-up system and intuitive app services make the app users feel free. Also, we don't just share comments and posts. When they're motivated and feel a sense of belonging by doing the routine with others, they can continue to practice their routines. Therefore, it motivates the middle age by providing a routine match based on the frequency of using apps and sharing experience. Now, oh, Nipperlo is conducting an online program to practice routines with 10 middle-aged retirees at Persa Tamakyo. Using NeighborBand, they authenticate their routines for three weeks and communicate with other participants with comments. People who participate in the program can feel and find the necessity of practicing routines. They continue to perform their routines that they couldn't do alone. 
based on the versatile food program, we produced whether the routine practice can change the sense of belonging and achievement. And we will improve the function of the application to suit middle-aged people. In addition, through connections with the, with the institution, we will expand this platform. So, middle-aged people can receive information about club activities. As a result, users can fill the gap in their lives. Plus, it paved the way for new challenges through continuous self-management. They can improve the sense of belonging by restoring social networks. Also, they can build empathy among middle-aged people in this community. Therefore, our project will change the daily life of retirees who experience the retirement after effect into a healthy day with our routine application. We would like to be a safe for single moms and middle-aged people. And we'll help them to move forward on their own. Temo and Lipro will be there. Thank you for all your attention.
서비스는 5만 원인데 뭐 돈이 되든 아니면 비즈니스 고려하지 않고 공간과 그대로가 이제 정보적인 비즈니스를 고려하고 있는지 저희가 이제 앞으로 모든 인터뷰를 진행하면서 얻었던 인사이트인데요. 기관에 계시면 분들이 직접 인터뷰를 진행했을 때 기관에 이미 존재하고 있는 동말이나 모임 같은 경우에 이걸 관리해 주는 분이나 아니면 이걸 나서서 관리할 분들이 없어서 이 모임이나 동말이나 지속되지 않는다는 그런 환경점을 드릴 수 있었어요. 그래서 저희가 이 플랫폼을 구축하게 되면 좀더이 비즈니스를 확장을 시켜서 기관과 연계해서 모임의 정보를 좀더 확인하실 수 있도록 좀 좋은 분들에게 제공할 예정입니다. 